view. It's going to be one hell of a pay-per-view here tonight. We are here at Orlando, Florida, and tonight is the night where we see rivalries finally come ahead. We see wars continue, and this is one that I feel like is just getting started. It is the Mayhem exclusive. It is Tommaso Ciampa going one on one with Samoa Joe the first time both of these two men have stepped foot on a pay-per-view and the crowd is obviously ecstatic and listen I don't blame them I got a feeling it's going to be one hell of a crowd all throughout the night here tonight and fully loaded it's going to be one hell of a show we have so much to go through here ladies and gentlemen and it's going to be one hell of a pay-per-view tag team action main event triple threat action man it just, it's just going to keep going and it doesn't stop here tonight I'm going to let you guys know the story for this one real fast. Tommaso Ciampa made his debut because his best friend Johnny Gargano got attacked by this man right here. The man who is coming out to a serenation of booze. The man known as Samoa Joe made his debut attacking Johnny Gargano, using Johnny Gargano as somebody that he was going to make his stepping stone here in the WWE. But that got sidetracked because Tommaso Ciampa put a halt to that. And now both of these two men not only are going to face each other tonight, but are also going to face each other in the coming weeks at the Starcade Tag Team Tournament as we are going through the round one. These two men are going to be facing in the ring as Johnny Gargano is set to come back at the Sarke Tag Team Tournament as he was going to be able to get some revenge on Samoa Joe. But, you know, the, the big thing tonight, the big story tonight is Tommaso Ciampa getting his hands on Samoa Joe for Johnny Gargano, him doing the job for him here tonight, maybe weakening him a little bit going into the Sarke Tag Team Tournament. And man, oh man, like I said, some things might not come ahead tonight, but things are definitely going to get started. And Tommaso Ciampa has had a lot to say or, excuse me, nothing really to say to Samoa Joe's just been trying to bring straight violence, but Samoa Joe's been the man that's had a lot to say to Tommaso Ciampa, and both these men just having a lot of anger in their heart, both of these men feeling like they have so much to prove here in the WWE as they are just coming here in the WWE, and oh man, Tommaso Ciampa tries to go for something there, but didn't get it, nicely done there by Samoa Joe, nice elbow drop there by Joe. Samoa Joe, man, not playing any games with Tommaso Ciampa in the early rounds in the matchup. Nicely done there by Tommaso Ciampa. Ciampa not playing any games with Samoa Joe. Looking to try to pick up Joe, but Samoa Joe, no, not allowing it. Straight super kick action here tonight by Samoa Joe, and the crowd is not enjoying it. I mean, do you blame when the crowd didn't? They definitely don't seem like they'd be into Samoa Joe more Tommaso Ciampa than anything, but this time gets that super kick again. Another knee to the face there. Nicely done there by Samoa Joe. And I said it before and I'll say it again. Samoa Joe making his pay-per-view debut here tonight along with Tommaso Ciampa. So both men have a lot to prove here tonight in this matchup. And now Tommaso Ciampa bouncing right off of the rope. Samoa Joe ducking under. Very beautiful work there. And oh my God. Scoop slam there by Samoa Joe. They don't call him the Samoa submission machine for no reason. And I feel like once he does lock in that coquina clutch is going to be all she wrote. Bit of a super kick party here tonight. Samoa Joe's been relying heavily on those super kicks here tonight at Fully Loaded. And ladies and gentlemen, to believe that this is just the start of one hell of a pay-per-view. The first time ever we have had two pay-per-views in one month. This is coming right off of the SummerSlam pay-per-view. So much, so much backlash from that pay-per-view. And it all comes ahead here at Fully Loaded. And Tommaso Ciampa, Ciampa seemed like he tried to... You know, throw throw himself at Samoa Joe in the early ons of the matchup, but oh my god, nicely done there by Champa. I was gonna say Champa hasn't really been doing the, the best, but he seems to be fighting his way back through this. And a big elbow drop there by Tommaso Champa. Beautiful work there by Champa. Champa now looking to go to the top rope. Not something that I personally have seen from Champa when I watched him on the indie scene, but we haven't seen much of Champa because this is Champa's debut match. Champa with a shoulder tackle, and imagine. Imagine if Tommaso Ciampa can win his debut matchup here tonight against Samoa Joe. And Samoa Joe being undefeated here in Universe Mode. And oh my God. Face getting slammed right off of the right off of the, uh, the corner of the ring there. Nicely done there by Tommaso Ciampa. And Ciampa now bringing Samoa Joe into the ring. Looked like he wants to take his time with Samoa Joe. Seems like he has a lot of hate in his heart for Samoa Joe because of what Samoa Joe did to his best friend Johnny Gargano. And Tommaso Ciampa not playing any games. It looks like he wants to set him up for something big. Fairy tales ending. Into the cover. One, two, and no. Oh. Samoa Joe kicking out of the fairy tales ending. The crowd telling Joe that he's not worthy. And Tommaso Ciampa trying to prove that to be so. Ciampa with a combination of strikes. And lays him down with the big knee into the cover one more time. Is he going to be able to put Joe away in this matchup? No. 
Referee doesn't even have to waste time on a two count. Samoa Joe kicking out with great effort, showing that he has a lot more left in the tank. And oh man, Samoa Joe, we knew this was going to be one hell of a matchup here tonight. We knew this one was going to be hard hitting between Samoa Joe and Tommaso Ciampa, but something that I couldn't have guessed. Oh my God. Something I couldn't have guessed was the amount of hatred that would be brought into the matchup. You could definitely see how much Johnny Gargano means to Tommaso Ciampa. I mean, Gar you know, Tommaso Ciampa was the one that was with Gargano through everything, through the rehabilitation when Johnny Gargano first got injured back in King of the Ring. And to see all of that, that could be going to waste by Samoa Joe. Wait a minute, now Joe looking to line up Tommaso Ciampa for something we've seen on Mayhem before. Oh, wait a minute, Ciampa getting go! Tossed over and through. And Tommaso Ciampa not looking the best in this matchup. This might be all she wrote for Ciampa. Two and oh. Not even a two count. Tommaso Ciampa staying in it. And a big super kick. But no, this time. This time. Ciampa says no. Ciampa picks him up. Power bomb. Ciampa power bomb. Samoa Joe. Joe's no easy man to lift. But Samoa Joe with a kick out at one. Big Tommaso Ciampa. Champa couldn't do it in the first time in the matchup, but he did it the second time. Samoa Joe, though. Joe clipping Champa, and now Joe lining up Champa for something big here. Lining up Champa for what could to be the beginning of the end. No man's been able to get out of this one, and he has it locked in. The Kokina clutch, the clutch is locked in. Champa has nowhere to go, nothing to do. Champa's fading. Oh my God, he's trying to fight back, but he's fading. His arms is failing in the air, and there's nowhere he can go. Nothing he can do. Champ has to tap. Champ has to just tap. There was absolutely nothing that Tommaso Champa could have done in this matchup. Tommaso Champa and Samoa Joe fought. And you got to think that come Starcade, there's going to be a lot more fight left in both of these men's tanks. Because, man, oh, man, it's going to definitely be good going into the Starcade Tag Team Tournament. And I think this one just took the cake on building up to be. And wait a minute, Tomo Samo Joe's not done with Tommaso Ciampa. Ciampa's groggy, but Joe, Joe attacking him with a kendo stick. Come on. Come on, the match is over, Joe. What the hell? Oh, my God, wait, 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 wait. That's, that's Johnny Gargano. Gargano's back! Gargano's back at all! Gargano lays out Samoa Joe as Champa getting back up to his feet. Champa's getting back up to his feet and seeing, seeing that Johnny Gargano's right there. We're seeing a different angle of it. And as Samoa Joe leaves the ring, Johnny Gargano and Tommaso Champa DIY is showing off in Samoa Joe. Joe looks pissed off, but Samoa Joe might have to go backstage and find Mr. Money in the Bank because come two weeks' time, it's going to be DIY versus the uh, very odd pairing of Samoa Joe and Bronson Reed. It's going to be damn good.